2010 metais LKL bronzos medalius laimėjas ir tais pačiais metais geriausio lygo snaiperio titulą iškovojas Derikas Laus sugrįžo į Lietuvą. Gruodžio mėnesį jis sudarė sutartį su pasvalio pieno žvaigždžių ekipa ir tapo pagrindiniu šios ekipos įžaidėjų. Lietuvos krepšinios ir galiams Lau yra gerai pažįstamas. Prieš šešerius metus jis atstovavo Šiaulių komandai ir buvo vienas šios ekipos lyderių. Po to įžaidė Izraelyje, Ukrainoje, Turkijoje, kol galiausiai prieš porą savaičio apsivilko pieno žvaigždžių marškinėlius. Lietuvoje jis sutiko pažįstamas komandas ir krepšininkus, o pats sako, besidžiaugintis galimi be žaisti pasvalyje. Aš nekai turėjau pasvalyje, kad jau turėjau į Lietuvainiją, kad Lietuvainiją yra gaudai lygą. Bet, jau, 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 I enjoyed my experience in Cholet and in Lithuania and that you know if I ever had a good opportunity with uh, with a team that that was a good situation for me basketball wise as well that I would have came back. Uh, the situation is good. Um, they're giving me opportunity to play um, you know to kind of uh, get back into it. Uh, um, you know the coach is a, is a young coach but he he showed that he, he really really um, wanted to bring me here and you know it, It's a good sign when, when, when a coach has a lot of interest in you like that, you know, he has a lot of confidence in you and he's going to allow you to play your game. That for me is the best kind of situation. You know, it doesn't make sense to go to a club where the coach is going to try and change you and make you play a different style because then it doesn't work out for anybody. So here the situation coach allows me to play like how I play and uh, he has confidence in me, he gives me confidence and you know, I think that all in all makes a good situation. Į pasvalį lau atvyko metus niekur nežaidęs. Praėjusį sezoną jis nusprendė paskirti savo ir savo šeimai. Todėl liko gimtuosiose Havajuose bei profesionaliai nežaidė. Nors toks sprendimas profesionaliam žaidėjui yra itin retas, lau sako, kad tai padėjo jam iš naujo pamilti krepšinį. Ne, jūs nežinau nežinau nežinau. Jūs nežinau 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 Uh, it's more about um, just being with my family and uh, and staying home and enjoying all the things that you know I wouldn't get to enjoy when I stay 10 months up over here, you know, in, in Europe. So I, I was kind of just over it, and I was just I just wanted to be with my family, and you know I got to I got to see spend birthdays with my family that I never ever got to really do Christmas, New Year's, Thanksgiving. I got to spend everything, you know, when I took the year off, and it was definitely a good thing to do, not career-wise, it's terrible, but as far as, uh, you know, just um, to ground myself, to, um, you know, just kind of touch ground again and, and, and spend time with those people that you don't spend a lot of time with, it was, it was, it was awesome. So. How did people around you react to that? <laughs> I had like agents, you know, um, uh, one agent told me like, uh, I, got, I got jobs for you, and I was like, Oh no, it's okay. I'm gonna stay home. I don't want to play, you know. And he was like, "What? You know, what? Are you crazy? Like, you are one of the you're one of my my favorite players. Like, how? I don't I don't. He couldn't understand, you know. And you know, some fam family members were just like, "Oh, what are you doing home?" And you know, I'm like, "Wow, I'm just I'm just home. Like, I'm taking a break and." you know, enjoying home and, you know, they're like, oh, okay, well, because they've never seen me home during this whole time, you know, and so, um, you know, it's definitely a lot of mixed feelings, but, um, you know, all in all, I think um, after explaining, I think they kind of understood, so, all right. Šių metų šventės Lau sutiko Lietuvoje, tačiau čia jis tikrai nesijautė vienišas. Įžaidėjų kompanija palaikė jo geras bičiulis Arvidas Šikšnius. I actually spent um, Christmas Eve with, uh, with my old teammate. Arvidas Shikshinis from um, Neptunas. He was my he was my good good friend from Cholet. And uh, when I was here, um, he 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 brought me to his family's house in Kretinga for um, for 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 Christmas five six years ago. And so when I came back here, I was like, Hey, what's up? What are you doing? He's like, You gotta come to Kretinga. It's Christmas, you know. So I drove three hours to Kretinga, uh, you know. And so that was a, a long journey, but. Well worth it. I got to see the, his family again, and you know, just it's just good to be around um, people, um, familiar faces during those kinds of holidays. So I was fortunate to have a friend like him and a family, you know, to to hang with. So. Lithuania lau sutiko ir daugiau matytų veidų. When I first came to Lithuania, I went immediately to um, Piano Zvagja's game in Utenos, and I saw Coach Sereka, 
And so we were talking star we were, we were talking a lot and you know he was like, Oh Derek, oh why you didn't tell me you were coming? You know, this is that but you know it's good to see him. Um, you know, and just a lot of familiar faces that I remember from back then. You know, I remember playing against Stepas. Um, you know, I um, uh, I remember Idas Viscontas, I played against him, you know. I played against Calnietis and um, Pochis and you know a whole bunch of players and uh, you know, it's just good to see them. And from Ritas, Davidus, Galius, and Gorelicus, and all those guys. So there's a lot of familiar faces, and that I got to, um, I got to say hello to again. So. Iš Hawaii kilęs lau gimtajam kraštu jau čia šiltus jausmus. Universitete jis savo protėvių garbė užsiaugino ilgus plaukus. O dabar jo kairė koja puošė didelę havajietišką tatuiruotę. This represents some um, family genealogy, so it kind of like explains where my family came from and, and stuff, so. There's not too much people from Hawaii that are playing. As a matter of fact, there's me and someone you guys might know well, you know, Rashawn Brodus. You know, we grew up playing basketball together and we're really good friends. And, you know, there's really us, only us two. And, um, you know, so we definitely have a sense of um, representing uh, something much bigger than ourselves, but uh, a state, you know, so that's pretty cool.